We have a question from a student. It's a quadratic modelling problem. It's from an A-level maths paper. Um, the question states that a rugby ball is kicked and it reaches a max vertical height of 12 metres and it hits horizontal ground 40 metres from where it was kicked. Of course, um, there are some modelling assumptions here, uh, one of them being that the horizontal surface, the ground, is flat um, and some other ones as well, which we won't go into too much detail on. Uh, but how would I approach this problem? Um, these, this is one of the kind of problems where you're given a graph and you need to get the equation. And one way we can do it is we can determine what the roots of the quadratic graph are. Um, and if it hits the ground 40 metres from where it was kicked, we can put 40 down here, x is 40, and over here we have x is 0. Now one property of the quadratic graph is that it's symmetrical. And because it's symmetrical, it, sees it, it says it reaches max vertical height of 12 metres, we know that the y corner of the turning point maximum height is 12, and this must be 20. Now what we can do now is we can now link h with x uh, by saying this, h is equal to, I'm going to purposely make a mistake, h is equal to x brackets x minus 40. Uh, let me explain the reasoning behind this. First of all, one of the roots is x is 0, the other root is x is 40, x1 and x2 is 0 and 40. Uh, but the reason this is incorrect, and there's a reason why I left the space here, the reason this is incorrect is because, um, well, we don't have the correct scale factor in the vertical direction. Uh, we need to put a constant here that compensates for the fact that, well, if it was just x is 0 and x, x brackets x minus 40, it would look like this, right? It would be a positive parabola, let's say, or positive coefficient for the x squared for the um, so what I'm going to do is put a capital A here. This is my scale. You can use any letter. What I'm going to do now is use the coordinate that I haven't used, which is the non-root coordinate, which is the turning point, the 20, 12. I'm going to substitute that in, and that's going to give me the value of A. So 12 is equal to A multiplied by 40, multiplied by, not 40, 20, excuse me, 20. Uh, brackets 20 take away 40. Uh, that gives me minus 400a is equal to minus uh, is equal to 12 rather and that gives me a is equal to minus 3 over 100 and I did expect a negative number because you can see by the shape it should be a negative number. Uh, I'm just going to write over here that gives me the quadratic model is h equals minus 3 over 100 x brackets x minus 40. Now I don't need to expand because the question didn't specify that I had to give it in a particular form. There was also another way I could do this question. I could use the turning point. I could do, well, basically put a scaling factor on the, well, essentially this. I'm not going to do the entire way, but I could do h is equal to a brackets x minus 20 squared plus 12. And I can substitute in the coordinates I haven't used, which are 40, 0, or 0, 0, to work out capital A as well.